Top 10 World's Best Off-Road SUVs Trucks and SUVs rule the world, but not all of them can go any place in the world. That's reserved for true off-roaders. Be it rock crawlers, desert pre-runners, or trailhounds, they all thrive where the pavement ends. Many trucks and SUVs have names that suggest they can go boldly wherever they damn well please, but those are often just appearance packages or trim levels. Here is a top 10 list of legit off-roaders available for 2021. These are serious trail-ready beasts with low-range crawler gears that feed all four wheels, suspensions high enough to clear obstacles, and underbody plates that'll protect the mechanical bits when you're rock crawling. The only way to earn a spot on this list is by demonstrating true ability and stalwart ruggedness. Starting our list at number 10, we have the Ford F-150 Raptor, priced at $5,300-$500. The Ford Raptor is more than an amazingly capable off-road truck. It's a cultural icon, a prestige product, and a total badass. It's not built to squeeze through trails, but it gobbles up open desert at high speed and even jumps sand dunes. There are jumping limits, however. Just check it out on YouTube. It's a Baja racer in spirit, with an aggressive wide-body appearance, a 450-horsepower twin-turbo V6, and a long travel suspension. With a terrain management system and a fancy Fox internal bypass dampers, the Raptor is ready for a variety of flight patterns. While its standard 34-inch BF Goodrich all-terrain TAKO2 tires are available with beadlock wheels, a rear electronic locking differential with 410 gears is standard, and a Torsen Limited slip front differential with 410 gears is optional. The Raptor is radical. Next at number 9, we have the GMC Canyon AT4, priced at $2,500-$700. For extreme off-road use in a mid-sized truck, the General Motors product that rocks is the Chevy Colorado ZR2. But here's the GMC Canyon, the Colorado's near twin brother, and new for 2021 in this Husky AT4 package that replaces last year's Canyon All-Terrain. The AT4 comes standard with an off-road suspension, front skid plate, and 31-inch Goodyear Wrangler Duratrack tires. There's also a rear electronic locking limited slip differential and a different looking front bumper to give it that special look. The standard powertrain is a 308 horsepower 3.6 liter V6 with an 8-speed automatic. But an optional 181 horsepower turbo diesel with 6-speed auto is also available. The AT4 can be built as an extended cab with the 6-foot box or as a crew cab with either the 6- or 5-foot box. Max towing capacity is 7,000 pounds. There's also a GMC Acadia AT4, but it's mostly cosmetic changes that don't improve capability. Next at number 8, we have the Ram Power Wagon, priced at $55,050. Power Wagon is a name that dates back to the days just after World War II, when Dodge was repurposing its military trucks for civilian duty. Today's Power Wagon is based on the Ram 2500 HD, a truck built to get jobs done, not just for looks at the off-road park. The Power Wagon has a lifted suspension for increased ground clearance, greater approach, and departure angles. It also adds off-road essentials like locking front and rear differentials and a disconnecting front anti-roll bar. The front-mounted winch can handle up to 12,000 pounds should all hell break loose. The Power Wagon comes equipped with a 410 horsepower 6.4 liter gas-fed V8. Next at number 7, we have the Jeep Grand Cherokee Trailhawk, priced at $45,000. The Grand Cherokee Trailhawk is a legit off-roader. There's standard air spring suspension that can be lifted at the push of a button to provide up to 10.8 inches of ground clearance. It also features a trick all-wheel drive system with a two-speed transfer case and an electronic limited slip rear differential. The Trailhawk's many selectable traction control settings are Hill Ascent and Hill Descent modes, which help to manage speed on angled surfaces. For 2020, changes are scant. There's a single pane sunroof and some trim changes. The standard power plant is the familiar 285 horsepower 3.6 liter V6, with the 360 horsepower 5.7 liter version of the Hemi V8 optional. Next at number 6, we have the Lexus GX priced at $53,000. Over the past few years, the Lexus GX has earned cachet as a luxury SUV that has real ability. Built like a real truck, with body-on-frame construction, the GX uses a self-leveling suspension with optional adaptive dampers. The full-time four-wheel drive and the two-speed transfer case combined for goat-like off-road abilities. And don't you just crave an SUV that's comparable with a goat? Power comes from a 4.6-liter V8, rated at 301 horsepower. Those features are joined by low-range gearing, a limited slip center differential, hill descent control, active traction control, and available crawl control. That last one helps the GX maintain low speeds in forward or reverse while traversing uneven surfaces and challenging obstacles. 
Next at number 5 we have the Ford Bronco, priced at $34,700. Your prayers have been answered, the Ford Bronco is back in a big way. It's offered in two or four door layouts with a new 7 speed manual transmission, optional 35 inch tires, removable top and doors, and an infotainment that can download trail maps and navigate them without any Wi Fi or cell service. The body mounted mirrors mean taking the doors off won't cost you much, and a pullout table is also an option for the rear area. A 270 horsepower 2.3 liter EcoBoost 4 cylinder or a 2.7 liter EcoBoost V6 with a claimed 310 horsepower. There's no V8 option, just turbo. Both body styles have a 3,500 pound towing capacity. Ford is currently taking $100 refundable deposits, and the Ford Bronco is expected to go on sale spring 2021. Next at number 4, we have the Jeep Gladiator, priced at $3,540. The new 2020 Jeep Gladiator builds on the four door Wrangler's successful appealing formula by adding a pickup bed to its tail. That also means a stretched wheelbase that seriously improves the everyday ride quality. It's the easiest Wrangler derivative to use and drive, and that made it a member of CD's 2020 10 best list. Like a proper Wrangler, the roof and doors can be removed. An optional disconnecting front anti-roll bar increases axle articulation over uneven terrain, and substantial 33-inch BF Goodrich KM all-terrain tires, while optional, look cool and help with traction. Various trims are available up to the Rubicon model. The base engine is a 285 horsepower 3.6 liter V6 with the speed manual transmission. But Jeep recently added a 260 horsepower 3 liter turbo diesel with an 8 speed auto. Gladiator Rubicon and Mojave both offer 11 inches of ground clearance. At number 3, we have the Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro, priced at $3,800. The Toyota 4Runner is built for serious work, not just profiling at Target. Every 4Runner is capable, but the 4-wheel drive only TRD Pro is the beastly one. With an electronic locking rear differential, thick underbody skid plates, 2.5-inch Fox internal bypass dampers, and specially tuned front springs that help raise the nose by 1 inch. New for 2020 is an 8-inch touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility atop the center of the dash. There's also a digital display between the speedometer and tachometer for monitoring the vehicle's behavior. So now you can crawl off-road while being reassured that you have oil pressure. Next at number 2 we have the Jeep Wrangler, priced at $5,800-$680. This is what Jeep is supposed to look like, tracing its lineage back through all the CJ models to the first military MB. Here's the Jeep Wrangler. Familiar looks go with brilliant performance straight out of the box. Every model has four-wheel drive and two solid axles. Its two- and four-door body styles can easily be stripped down, leaving them doorless and or topless for unrivaled exploration exposure. The Jeep provides 10.9 inches of ground clearance, an approach angle of 44 degrees, and a departure angle of 37 degrees. Its front and rear axles can be fitted with locking differentials and share a two-speed transfer case with low-range gear ratios for optimal crawling capability and traction. A disconnecting front anti-roll bar and beefy 33-inch BF Goodrich KM all-terrain tires are included on the hardest core Rubicon trim. And lastly, ending our list at number 1, we have the Mercedes-Benz G-Class. Priced at $131,750, Mercedes has been building the G-Class since 1979 and initially it wasn't supposed to be sold to civilians. It was a military vehicle built to take punishment and be easy to fix. The four-wheel drive system of today's G-Class is among the most advanced there is, with a trio of locking differentials that can be manipulated to climb mountains. The G-Class lost its solid front axle in its redesign, but it offers a respectable 9.5 inches of ground clearance and can wade through 27.6 inches of water. In the US, the G-Class is offered in two models. There's the G550 powered by a twin-turbo 4-liter V8 rated at 416 horsepower. That's no slouch. Still, it's no AMG G63. That beast is powered by a 577 horsepower version of the same engine. That's a boxy rocket ship. Oh yeah, it's dang expensive too. And with that being said, we've come to the end of our video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit the subscribe button for more awesome videos just like this one. And hit the bell button so that you don't miss out on our next videos. Also, let us know which car you like the best in the comments section below. This has been Cars and Coffee. Thanks for watching.